In your Excel table, you want to calculate the actual number of hours that an employee worked. This learning module will show you how to perform calculations with time. In Excel, time values, hours, minutes and seconds are stored as numeric values between 0 and 1. The number 1 represents 24 hours, 0 0.5 represents 12 hours and so on. Excel automatically recognizes a value as a time if you enter it using colons as separators. To calculate the number of hours worked each day, click first in the cell where you wish to make the calculation. Now enter a formula to make the calculation. Work end C4 minus work beginning B4 minus lunch break D4. Press enter to finish the formula and carry out the calculation. Then use autofill to copy the formula into all cells down to cell E8. To calculate the total number of hours worked, click the Sum button in the Editing group on the Home tab. As you can see, the calculated value appears to be wrong. This is because Excel can only display hour values greater than 24 hours if a certain format is applied to the relevant cell. To do this, Click the dialog box launcher in the number group on the Home tab. Then, on the Number tab, select the Time category. And in the Type area, select the 37 colon 30 colon 55 format. This format also causes seconds to be displayed. But since you don't want to display them, you must modify the format. To do so, click on the Custom category. The current time format, hours, colon, minutes, colon, seconds, semicolon, at, appears in the type area. Now click on the Type Entry box and delete the colon seconds characters. The calculated number of total hours worked now displays properly without the seconds.